We roam the still, cold world. No horizon in sight. The rulers of old, stripped of pride and glory. It feels as yesterday we were turning the wheels of progress. Until the frost stopped it all. Suddenly, without a warning. When tides had changed, they changed for all of us, no matter wealth or class. We have lost our world to snow. And with it, our last traces of humanity. We bid farewell to plenty. And for those who remained, came the time to adapt. We decided to leave our homes and head north. We roamed for weeks, maybe months, leaving behind all the things we once believed had made us. It was hope that pushed us forward. Slowly, step by step, knew the cost of our journey, and we paid the price a hundred times. Finally, the time has come to build the last city on Earth. Well then, a new home. We fled from London and crossed the sea to reach the frozen north. On the way, our convoy was hit by a blizzard and scattered. A handful of us managed to reach the site of this generator, only to find it frozen solid and abandoned. Why is no one here? Did any of our people survive the blizzard? Are there any others out there? Whatever we do, we should expect the worst now that the world as we know it has crumbled. We have to survive. Well, that was a beautifully narrated little video clip. I really enjoyed that. Obviously, the world's coming to an end. We need to kind of survive. And I guarantee under my rule, they will not. Fight the cold. We need to get the generator working. It provides heat and power to other buildings. Without it, we'll freeze to death. Stockpile some coal and start the generator. Okay, so let's pause the game real quick. We need to check out the UI. We need to make sure where we know where everything is. You guys know where everything is, but you might already do that if you've already played it. So we can already see up the top, we have coal, we have wood, steel, steam cores, our temperature. We have raw food, food rations, our current time of day, which then the temperature will drop significantly two levels. Is that two levels in Celsius? Uh, we also have our time, our work time. We have discontent, where people are content, not for long. Uh, a construction menu. This UI is super nice. Um, we also have dismantled building, health food, da 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 da. Nice. Uh, book of Laws. Ad uh, adaption. Find ways to battle hunger, sickness, and apathy. Okay, so I'm guessing Book of Laws is going to be like the laws we have to provide upon the people, like extra working hours, food rations, and all that kind of stuff. We also have the economy tab, extraction efficiency, building, coal pile, workforce, bloody bloody blah, blah, daily gain, coal balance, coal storage. We can also see everything else, what we need. Down in the bottom right, we also have unemployed, uh, which is our 50 idle workers. We also have 15 idle engineers uh, and 15 children. So we need to get 200 coal and we need to turn on the generator. Uh, let's have a move around here. Um, we, also, we have this. Steel wreckage. Uh, requires at least one worker. Workforce will extract steel. Uh, we've got wood crates. What's this? Coal. Here we go. This is what we need. We need uh, some coal. So let's go into here. Let's get into resources and put down a gathering post. 
Um, now the question is, is if it's green, does that mean it's in range? Uh, or what? I, I actually don't have a clue. Uh, I'm just going to presume it is. Uh, and how do we rotate? Can we rotate this thing? It doesn't look like we can because it looks like it's on like a spherical kind of grid based system. So as we can see this road here, then the further I move it away, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So let's kind of just put this here so we can grab some coal, we can grab some steel, and hopefully that will be all fine and dandy. So we're going to put that there. We're going to hit play and just see what happens because they need to come over here and build it. Uh, these are kind of slowly making their way over here. This is as far as we can zoom in, but we can see all of our people hanging around this massive Goliath of an engine right here. And this is going to be what's going to be keeping our people warm. Uh, we are at minus negative 20 right now. These are slowly moving over here. Let's kind of speed up time a little bit. I don't want to kind of too, do too much speeding up because I, I understand we do have to micromanage everything and make sure that everybody is fine and dandy. Otherwise, we're going to cause riots. People are going to die. People are... Uh, chaos will unfold. All right, so we've just got the building unlocked. Uh, inoperable. Uh, inoperative. Requires at least one worker. Okay. Workers. Let's... I guess we can bring in 10. Let's get 10 workers. Uh, streets. You can move the camera with your mouse while holding the right mouse button. And you can also... Yeah, yeah, that's camera controls. Resources and workforce. Resource management is crucial to the city's survival. You need coal to power the generator. Wood and steel are necessary for construction and research. Steam cores are key part of our advanced buildings. Raw food is used to prepare food rations in the cookhouse. And later in the game, more res resource types may appear. Then we've also got streets. All structures in the city must be connected to the generator with streets. Otherwise, they won't function. To build uh, a street, open the construction menu. Okay, so do I need to put a street? Where's... Where's... Oh, this is this build street. Here we go. Do I build a street here? And connect this to uh, the center here? I'm guessing that will allow them to get there faster, maybe, as well. And also maybe provide heat and power? Oh, it did provide power, because now this has got some steam. We have movement. And these are going over here to grab the steel and start breaking that down. What is that? Night is coming. Put down your tools. Oh, so they just started work. And two minutes later, they've been told not to stop working. The generator. You can speed up time by clicking... Da -da 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 -da. Uh construction use the construction menu at the bottom yeah yeah we kind of got that it is invalid placement yeah yeah cool the generator is the heart of the city and the only source of heat in this frozen hall you must turn it into as soon as uh, you must turn it on as soon as you stockpile enough coal the generator heats a circular zone around it consuming at least six units of coal per hour you can research generator upgrades that raise the heat output expand the heat zone and reduce coal usage Okay, so we can turn that on. Shut down. Steam level one. Inoperative. I'm guessing we, we, we've only got 15 coal right now. What if I turn it on? Okay, that's pretty... That's... That, that's... That's pretty cool. One hour left. So I want to I wanna bring the temperature up, and then let's shut it down. And I'm guessing the heat will stay around for a little bit. We can slowly see that heat drop in here. But at least they've got a little bit of heat, a little bit of happy... Oh my god, my discontent's gone up though. What's this? Housing problem. No roof over our heads. Captain, people are understandably concerned about the lack of shelter. They've fallen ill from sleeping outside in the terrible cold. We'd better do something about it. I'll provide some shelter. Do not worry. Let's do that. Let's look into construction. Let's look into uh, the people. Okay. Um, we need more wood. We need more wood. Uh, I can't do that yet. The wisdom of the crowd. Captain, when facing demands, remember this. People usually look for the quicker solution. Not the best one. You don't have to, uh, you don't have to agree to everything they ask for. If you fix the problem your way, it's fine. Okay, good to know. Thank you. So, there is some stockpiles here. And this is literally our... They got, they got food. 25 a day from steel and we're receiving 120 a day of coal uh, and the generator is yep, shutting down we kind of know that 
we have a little bit of heat i feel like we need more wood maybe is that because i need stockpiles is that a thing i need I, have i messed up already i feel like i might have messed up already because i don't have any wood oh wait no i can just i can just do that right and then that means people will just go through there and get the stuff and come back okay we can do that but then the gathering post allows people to go there and go there and wider area sort of thing right maybe question mark i'm going to speed up time here a little bit uh it is like what whoa the heating is off the generator is down yeah that's fine that is fine the temperature is in, inside a building depends on the power setting of the generator if the building is in the heat zone that building insulation and the conditions outside there are six temperature levels comfortable livable chilly cold very cold and freezing keeping homes and places as warm as possible helps prevent people from falling ill some places might become inoperative if the temperature falls too low okay good to know try to keep people warm so we have one sick right now and we also have 80 homeless i know i need and i know i need jobs i'm going to speed up time we need to get to a working day which i'm hoping oh oh great one of our people has just died sickness accidents and a deadly cold will keep claiming lives in this harsh world we need a way to dispose of the body people can take care of it themselves or open the book of laws consider signing a cemetery of corpse disposal law what is this oh my god there's a tech tree cemetery we will establish a burial ground so we can lay our dead to the rest with dignity and respect after introducing this law another one can be passed after 18 hours we'll also get a new building the cemetery hope will rise slightly no risk of disease from unburied bodies but the negatives will be each burial will keep some of the people from work for a few hours you will have to establish a cemetery okay I, i'm okay with this i'm okay with this Listen, everyone. New law is signed. yes you are very welcome now why does it look like they're all dead earth to earth ashes to ashes dust to dust as it should be at least after death we'll be allowed to re to rest properly i'm gonna speed up time here uh, everybody get a little bit warm what can i not turn this on oh crap i don't we don't have enough power to turn it on for an hour i should have left it running we're doing fine all things considered people froze to death some of our people didn't wake up today oh my god oh my how many people died i think we lost about 15 people okay people people are going back to work okay our hope is down five child died 19 adults and one unpopular oh my god we have literally just started i had to choose but i i had to put a call thing down i what was i meant to do oh my god right we we need to we need to aim for tents we need to get some tents up let's boom get our first tent down how many will this uh will this hold a tent uh, a thinly insulated shelter for 10 people to sleep in and how many people have we got 56 no 31 so either someone's going to sleep outside or i'm going to put one tent down for one person all right so that's another tent we need to get that wood back as soon as possible i'm just wondering if i should go into resources and try to build a gathering post over here because we've got wood wood and steel oh my god that that ended so quick i ended really quick i just put that in there we're then gonna get a path i'm just gonna bring you up. oh i need wood fantastic okay okay everybody to sleep let's get the uh fuel up the generator's on hopefully we can kind of leave this running overnight stockpile some coal we're gonna try and do that provide shelter for at least half your citizens and provide a place of rest for the dead okay we are slowly gonna work towards that we currently have 46 oh my god look at all these people five six staying home resting okay at least some people are gonna be inside we're gonna leave this fire on overnight as well we're gonna leave it on overnight just so people can stay warm it's a new dawn it's a new day get a move on chaps there's still plenty of work to do by john leg let's get to work we can't let up today yep critical shortage 
The number of sick is rising and we don't have enough materials to build a medical post. Perhaps a short burst of effort could help us gather the necessary resources. What's this one to me do? Emergency shift. Sometimes we have to concentrate on the task at hand uh, at the cost of everything else or die. After introducing this law, another one, okay? New ability. You can force workers in any facility to work for the next 24 hours. The negatives is using the emergency shift will raise discontent and discontent will raise slightly. We're signing that because we need some people to work overnight. Let's shut that down. Let's get some coal being stockpiled up again. Um, and then hopefully we can uh, get some people working in here. We're going to stop the people from grabbing the wood from there. And what's this? 17 are hungry. Are we out of food? Oh, we have raw food. We need to get a kitchen. Oh my God, you don't want much straight away, do you? People. Okay. Health, medical post, food, cookout. Shelter promi- Oh my God. Oh my God. People, tents. You, you, let's get them built. Get some houses for the, uh, from the night. Discontent is so, uh, so much things are red on my screen right now. This is crazy. The heating is off. Yes, I know. It's back on now, you spoon. What do you mean? People don't have hope in my abilities. How do I turn on this 24, 24 hours? Closed at this time of day. Okay, we got emergency shift. Can we put this on the emergency shift? Cool down two days. People will work for the next 24 hours. I can't put it on there. That's the one I need. Okay, well, apparently it's a new dawn. We've, we've got more people dead. We've got 27 people left. We have resource shortage. Yes, I understand this. We're not going to do any of this just yet. Unburied corpses. Oh my God, they're just lying in the streets. We need to get this burial thing done, uh, which I can't because I need 10 wood. Weather chain. Oh my God, it's 40 Celsius right now. It's 40 Celsius. I need wood. People are furious. Final warning. Sir, people are extremely discontent with your rule. A revolt could break out against you at any minute. What should we do? We must hold on for a couple of days. Are these just dead people here? They are, aren't they? I, I, I need to bring this down, but I need people to work. Inoperable. Is it because I need the road? Oh, I should have kept these working. Let me put pe people working back on them again. Because I'm not getting any... Oh, I've got wood. This is inoperable because uh, there's people there. I need a road to it. I need a road. Uh, road. There we go. And now it's night time. Oh my god, the rioting. The lack of homes stirs anger. Cap I, I, I'm trying to provide shelter. I, I will provide shelter. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just glad we've got enough coal to do what we can here. To keep people warm around here. We now need to fight back from this. People are eating raw food. That's fine. I'm okay with that. We need people to work here. I need people to get there because I need wood. Wood. Semi I know we failed that mission also. We have 20 people left. I need a cemetery built. Let's get the cemetery built. Where we've got 19 people left. Food. I can't build any for food because I need wood right now. We have 18 people left. The cemetery is up and running. The bodies are being dragged into the cemetery. I, if I, I'm not going to lie to you people. I would store them bodies in a freezer. I say in a freezer. You live in a freezer. And I would start taking their fingers off. And possibly using it as some sausages for a sandwich. I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. Because I feel like we might have to resort to cannibalism here. Okay, I'm going to put down a cookhouse. Get that being built. Hopefully that helps. What's this? The dangers of the cold, frostbite. One of our people has become gravely ill due to frostbite. This will keep happening if people have to work in such cold. I see. I, we, I can't do anything about it. Like, how do I get level two? Not research. You need 12 corn to turn this into steam level on. Plus two, plus two temperature. Oh, Jesus. Oh, range setting. Can increase range and overdrive. Whoa. When overdrive is on the temperature in all heat zones rises by one, but generated stress rises. Oh, okay. A child's plea. Captain, we found a boy frozen to the bone in the cemetery next to a fresh grave. He must have been there for hours. He wants you to call an emergency meeting. He says that if you agree, his mother will wake up to attend it. He must face his loss. Sorry, kid. Coal pile depleted. Uh-oh. A hunter's hut. I feel like that is going to be next thing we need. Let's kind of put that there. And let's put a street. Oh, I can put this. No, cancel, cancel, cancel. Hunter's hut. We can actually put that there. And then the the path, the street can actually go along there. 
like so. I need to check something. How many people we got working here? Let's bring that down to eight. Let's bring this one down to four. Let's remove the wood people from here. Let's bring two workers into the, the, the cookhouse, into the mess hall. Let's... We don't need one in there. We are going to need some hunters, though. So let's get four people in there. And we have ten kids. We have nine engineers. It looks like people are still kind of raging. And we might need to look into medical. Let's look into medical here. Healthcare protest. Urgent need for treatment. I'll open a medical post right away. Easy. It's already being built. I just need you guys to build it. Get building. Shelter promise broke. What do you mean? The promised shelter is nowhere in sight. People are bitterly disappointed. Wait. Wait, what? I have the shelter. We have three shelters. What do you mean? We need more coal. Uh, no government resources in range. Okay. We need to delete this then. Uh, building. Dismantle. Okay. Dismantle the streets as well. Get some resources back. And then we need to get some coal. So we need uh, another gathering post. What's this? Is this coal? That's coal and that's coal. Okay. Let's get a gathering post here. Just want to make sure this is kind of lined up here. Um, and then let's get a street. Build that along here. Like so. Treat the gravely ill. Open the book of laws. Okay, hold on to this. We'll try to do everything to cure the gravely ill from a massive surgery and amputations. The gravely ill will be treated in medical post. Hope will rise slightly. Negative 30% of the gravely ill treated in the medical post will be left as amputees. Discontent will rise slightly. Oh, okay. Hopefully that helps. Hear me, hear me. New law in the city. Healthcare promise fulfilled. Yes. Yes. We have people. Let's just slowly shut the generator off. So I can get this built over here because we need more coal. And then let's turn it back on again because people are panicking. Okay, in here. Let's bring in some workers. Uh, over here. Let's. We've got 18 U. Let's get 18 U. Uh, let's add another more food. We need hunters to go out. Everybody on hunting duty. Go, go, go. The captains are bloody full. Discontent falls. You have managed to place our people. Hope rises. Oh my god, the temperature's coming back. Temperature's dropping again. Have we only got seven people? Oh, these are idle workers. Never mind. I've been reading my people wrong this whole time. Right. So, we have this building here which is for engineers and this allows us to research i feel like this is going to be very important to the future of our colony now what housing riots the lack of home stirs anger i'll provide shelter i will provide shelter for everyone okay it's because i was reading this wrong i need more houses i need more houses uh i need more tents i apologize i will i will, I will, I will try and get this fixed but I need more wood for you two guys to do this. I thought it was the number on the left side, not the number on the right side, but this is employment. <laughs> Shelter promise fulfilled. You better believe it. Discontent is coming down. Five people being treated. Five hungry, three starving. Oh, God. Okay, at least some people are coming back. Two of our people have just died. Oh, bloody hell. I dreamt I was back in London. Oh my god, I'm starting to worry we'll lose what we have left. Everything's fine. Don't panic. Do not panic. Final warning, people are desperate. Sir, people are taking, talking openly about overthrowing you. Bury of hope. They see no future for our city and they blame you for that. What should we do? We must hold on for a couple more days. We will be fine. Stop panicking. Stop panicking. Oh, here we go. Heaters. Steam hub. So we, we can research now. So I want to look into that in a minute, but I need to get some streets down here. Hopefully that helps a little bit. So let's let's um, let's get some people uh, working in here. Get three people. Uh, and then let's look at the technology tree. So we have the steam hub, exploration and industry, a beacon, resources, coal thumper. What's this? Allows us to build coal thumpers. Coal thumper, by pumping pressurized water into an underground coal deposit, the coal thumper washes the precious resources to the surface, forming a pile uh, of up to 560 coal per standard workday, enough for two gathering ports. Yes, we need that. If we can get that, because that coal's about to run out, these coal's probably going to about to run out soon. 
so I need to get a thumper up as soon as possible. A word of advice, work is needed. There's so much to do and not enough hands to do it. A quick way of addressing this problem is to put our children to work. <laughs> oh, the hope is too long. Never mind. Never mind. We couldn't put them to work. I tried. Maybe make some kids. How about that? Make some kids. Uh, you know, maybe we put a law into that. The generator hums with reassuring warmth, but we shouldn't take it for granted. If the gen generator goes down, the city dies. Be mindful of coal res reserves. Now, food. There'll be no city if we starve to death. Secure a way of providing raw food and build a cookhouse to prepare meals. I have. I've just got hunters that apparently aren't doing anything. And people from our convoy. With basic resources secured for now, we can try to resource the people we left behind. Build a beacon. Scout Frostland and save as many survivors from the expedition as possible. You need a workshop to design plans for more advanced buildings. Oh boy. Family torn apart. Sir, a woman came forward after we built the workshop. She said her and her husband and daughter didn't reach the city within the with the main group. But she's sure they're, they're st still out there. She wants to join the first scout team we'll send out. She urges you to hurry. We'll do what we can. I I'm just trying to get us sustainable right now. Health protest. Urgent need for treatment. I I'm... Wait, we have one. I promise the sick will people will be treated. We have one here. What do you mean? Patience. About recovery time. Two days, three days, three days. Oh my god. It can only, oh, they can only hold five. <sighs> that would be why. We need another health uh, health uh, place. Okay, let's get so let's get one person working in the medical post again. I guess actually no. Let's bring two from there. Bring that up so there's three actually working e e each side of them now. I'm worried about the whole call as well. What's my temperature like? Temperature of these houses are okay, but it's not reaching over here. We can cook soup instead of full meals to feed more people with the same amount of raw food. I can't sign it. I don't have any hope. Okay, we really need to get this food up and running. That's our main problem right now, is food. Food is not happening. We have 10 people in here, but most of them need treatment. These are going to hunt. But I'm not seeing them bring food back. Standard could not be resumed production. Requires raw food. Oh my god. Your time has come. Lucky bastard. He'll die quickly. What does it change? We're doomed anyway. I'm glad I'll never see him again. Banishing him won't save us. But it's a relief. The end. You are banished. A band of grim men escorts you under the generator. The waiting crowd is silent. People observe you as you pass. Their faces blank as though you were watching snowfall. You, you are summarily judged and spurred the death sentence in recognition of your efforts. You are banished from the city instead. I did my best. I promise. <laughs>